just want to say that um, I'm very glad that you were back. It is great to have you back. So, welcome to the third installment of my 14 days of love and DIYs for February. And I think we're going to have a lot of fun today because I have a lot of really fun things planned. So make sure you subscribe to both of my channels so that way you will always be notified of my 14 days of love and DIYs. And I will link them right here and I will also link them below. Alright, so today for this DIY or Valentine It Yourself, I'm going to be showing you how to make this super cute and classic message or love letter in a bottle. And I have to say this is definitely the classic way to show your love for someone is you just write them a really beautiful love letter and you decorate a bottle and fill it with a lot of really cute and sparkly things sort of like what I did. And I'm going to be showing you exactly how I did it. So just in case you're wondering how I got everything into this bottle and got it situated and everything, I'm going to be showing you how to do that today. So I really hope that y'all enjoy this DIY and let's go ahead and get started. For this tutorial, you'll need a bottle with a cork top, sand, stationery, ribbon or twine, scissors, pen, glitterful foam decorations, extra trinkets of your choice, and of course, a tablecloth. And I just laid down my tablecloth because working with sand can get extremely messy. So next, I just opened up my bottle and began cutting the scrapbook paper to the perfect size. And this is the paper that we're going to be writing on. So now I'm just going to take the remainder of the paper and roll it up into a little funnel, which is the perfect funnel to pour my sand into so it doesn't get everywhere. And then I just began pouring in my sand and I poured it in about a quarter of the way up because I still want to have plenty of room to put everything into the bottle. So now it's time to begin writing my beautiful love letter. And I tried my best to write it in the finest cursive I possibly could, but unfortunately my writing skills are not up to par anymore. I think that's why I've decided to master type. Yeah, so be sure to write something from your heart that will really make your significant other's heart skip a beat and they'll be like Yeah, like that my letter states dear David you are the love of my life I never want to live without you that is why oops I'm sending you this message all the way across the Atlantic Ocean if you get this I've listed my cell number on the back love always and forever Breland heart heart Okay, so next, using a pen, I just rolled up my love later, 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 letter and taped it closed. And then next, I just used this tweed twine string or whatever it's called and tied it in a cute little bow around the taped parts. That way you can't see it. And then to make sure that the twine doesn't slide up and down, I just taped the back of the bow as well. Next, using some glitterful foam hearts, I'm just going to bend them in half and then drop them down into the sand. And using foam is so much easier than using paper hearts because it folds back out after you bend it. It's so neat. So after getting the big pieces in, I'm just going to use my scissors to stuff the letter into the bottle. And I also used a pencil to get everything situated as well. And next, using some fake rose petals, I'm just going to start putting them down into the bottle all around the letter. And I love how it just gives the entire bottle a Valentine's Day feel. And then after that, I'm just going to drop a few of these fake acrylic diamonds into the bottom just to add a little sparkle and shine. And they also give the bottle a treasure chest-like look. So pop the cork on and you're finished. watching me make this and I really hope that it'll give you some great ideas if you're planning on doing a classic love letter in a bottle and I just think it's such a sweet thing to give and it's so simple and it really touches your heart or it'll touch anyone's heart that you give it to because you put so much effort into it. So I thank you all so much for watching. Be sure that you subscribe to both of my channels so you will always get alerts as to when the 14 Days of Love and DIYs come out because there's going to be a lot of them. Thank you for watching. Have a glitterful Valentine's Day. Bye!
You wanna be my valentine? Yes you do, you wanna be my valentine? How about you? Everybody is my valentine, and so are you. And I just made this song up, so I hope, I hope you liked it. Okay, so now it's time for the Glitter Critter Anthem. Please subscribe!